festival. There's mum. She's letting dad know that she got safe. Yeah. And these are my friends, CJ and that's Ashley, and they're here to help put it all up. <laughs> yeah. And mum only just got here a bit late. So we should tell you about that in a bit. There we go. Yeah. Had a bit of a problem with our pictures a little bit tinier than the there was an extra meter book that we have not got but luckily next door shuffled up really close to their side so we've got just enough room hopefully but this is our location this year we're right at the back and previously we've usually been on that side we have been this side before but yeah that's all <laughs> Bye! I just remembered to get it all in. It's a good job I wasn't bringing any people. Luckily Ashley did that for me this time. I hope you didn't mind rain starting my weekly vlog for me this week. The ironic thing is I was busy texting Chris in that clip to say that I'd got here safely because I was a little bit worried. The journey here was a little bit fraught because I really smelt burning badly. Also there was a bad, loud squeak in this ca camper and then that suddenly stopped and then that was when the burning smell started. Luckily that all went away, all was fine but I thought I'd let him know I was here safely. And it turned out I texted rain by accident and I didn't realise until just a few minutes ago. So it's now 10 to 11, I'm going to go to bed. It's been drizzly for quite a while and actually it rained quite heavily just now. The good thing about that means that the groups that get together here sometimes are a little bit noisy at night. Just haven't, they are just have just gone to bed so hopefully I should be able to get a quite, a quite a good night's sleep. It's quiet at the moment which is brilliant. I should probably keep my voice down for making more noise than anyone. I've got an early start. I've got loads to do in the stall. I just completely flaked. I ran out of energy and I couldn't do it anymore. So, and my voice is a little hoarse because I don't often get the opportunity to sing in the car. I had old whole albums on and I was singing loudly to them the whole journey here, which, which was really good fun actually. So I'm just gonna say good night. I will um, try and talk to you tomorrow, it depends on how busy it is. I know last year I did not get the chance at all, but I am in a different spot. I don't know if I'm gonna be as busy as I was last year, so we shall see, and uh, hopefully the sun will shine, and I'll see you tomorrow. Good night. The queen was horror struck. She promised the man all of the riches of the kingdom if he would just leave her alone. Home and a child.
everyone, sorry I haven't had a chance to talk to you today. It's been a good busy day today and made my pitch fee, made my 400 the streamers, petrol money and the new changing tent. You do like to know you've made your money back. I've put the camera up to say hello but I am so exhausted I can't think of anything to say. Yeah, we're just having a beautiful sunset behind the flags there. <laughs> There's Rain and CJ and Ashley who've been helping me all day. Finally got to eat and I've just had a bottle of cider as well. So I'm a little bit more relaxed now. Actually, it's been not too bad a day. I think I've done enough of these festivals now that I sort of, I just generally am a bit calmer. I know what I'm doing now. And most of the labels are already all done. All the clothes are labeled in advance. And generally I know what I'm doing, so it's not so stressful. <laughs> Oh, okay, I'll just say goodnight. I think I'll just end today's vlog here and um, yeah, I'll say goodbye. See you later. Hello, Hello lovelies again. Oh, Hello. Oh, wow. so nice. nice. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Yeah. Good morning. It's Sunday today and um, yeah, the festival is in full swing again and already had a couple of sales, so that's not bad and yeah, it's looking good. If I go quickly, that is because someone's just come in the store. Um, Rain's going to take over the vlogging camera again for a minute. I think she's going to take it around the site just to show you what other stuff's going on. There's a lot here and yeah, it's a really good festival. It's just got bigger and bigger every year we've come. And now I would say it's a full blown proper festival with things to do everywhere. So if you don't come this year, make sure you get tickets next year because I know it's sold out this time. Don't forget next year, middle of August, look out for the new Forest Fair Festival. Thought you could have sold it in Glastonbury. <laughs> Do that? Nope, nope, this is not a friendly yeah, horse. Like Let, let's just go to a different horse. They Well, thank you for all your help. I feel like I just dropped some tissue down my top. That's nice, isn't it? Oh, I bet I've oh, been there all the time. I had it tucked in my bra when I went to the loo earlier. I just had this bulge of tissue in my. <laughs> nice. Okay, bye then. Bye! <laughs>
<laughs> We're all packed up. Where was once a pitch is now green grass again. And actually for once, I'm not the last ones here. There's still a few other people still to go, which is unusual. Oh, I'm so cross someone nicked our badge in Newquay. It looks a little bit undressed without it. So yeah, I haven't really had a chance to show you these beautiful surroundings. And normally, oh, there are deer over there. Okay, I'm gonna zoom in to show you the deer. There they are. It's a little bit shaky because they're so far away. Just wandering through. I managed to fit it in a lot better than I normally do. I'm quite pleased with that. But I still have no idea how I managed to fit two people in the bat once. Right, I'm off home now then. I'll see you guys at home. So I'm going to try and show you some of the scenery if I can. I might stop on the way out because the New Forest, if you've never been in, in Hampshire in England, it is beautiful here. And I don't know, I just seem to be lucky every time we've been, apart from one when it was miserable. On the Sunday evening, it's just this beautiful, glorious summer evening light and it is just, just beautiful. I get to see a bit of it as I drive out. There goes Ashley. <laughs> I sat down here and I realised I haven't seen my keys all weekend. They were in the back of the boot. I've got some shelves right at the back of the boot and the boot wouldn't unlock, wouldn't open. So I've just had to climb through all that stuff I just showed you to retrieve the keys. Oh God, there's always something, isn't there? There has to be something. Anyway, I've managed to put you on this sort of tripod here and I could turn you this way so you can see some of the lovely scenery as I leave. Here we go. morning everybody it's Monday it's all over I've just had breakfast my first sort of proper meal in about three days and it's now time to unpack <sighs> I feel a bit rough and uh, I look a bit rough but we've got to get on I've got so much to do the problem was because I had so much going on before the festival the trip to America the photo shoots and all that sort of thing the planning for the new forest fairy festival was all very manic and last minute and since her last vlog I made three goddess dresses, three kids dresses, a whole load of jewellery and stuff to take to the festival as well as just getting the displays ready and things like that and so now I've just got so much tidying up to do because I didn't clear any of it up when I did it <laughs> and so yeah it's gonna be a busy week just cleaning up from the mess that I made last week Oh well, it's all over. It seemed to go really quickly this year. Quicker than usual, I think. Wasn't quite as busy. I don't know, I had a different pitch. I was way at the back this year rather than next to the stage. So it was kind of nice. It was quieter, which was nice. And I, I felt calmer not having to shout to customers over the noise of the music. Over It's not noise, it's great music that they have on the stage. But it was a bit of a relief not to shout at everybody because then yeah you just get a headache at the end of the day overall i'm really pleased i sold three of my velvet cloaks that i recently made a lot of people were interested in them as well which is really nice when you make a bunch of new stuff that you've not done before it's quite a relief when people are actually interested in them so that was good it was so lovely to meet some of you guys that came along and said hi and yeah thank you it was really nice to meet you and i hope you had a lovely festival it's all over now got to unpack because we're going away in this again soon This is all the stuff that belongs upstairs or in my study. So I'm going to take that in first. There's still the gazebo and the rest of the clothes rails to go away. And also, of course, all the clothes, which are all in the boot bit. So actually, I'm going to put this lot away first and then I'm going to move the camper forward because all that goes either in the garage or in the basement. So that's the other way. Oh, 
I'm knackered already now I'm putting it away yet. I'm so tired. Hello everyone, I confess it's Thursday so I am running a bit late with the vlog and I'll actually be starting next week's vlog this afternoon. I've got some fun things coming up in the, over the next couple of weeks so if you're new here please do hit that subscribe button below. I hope you enjoyed looking at the new Forest Fairy Festival and if you were there I hope you had a good time. We were so lucky with the weather, it was it was just lovely. Yeah, what have I been doing? I've been editing videos, um, a new one has just gone up. It's another clothing haul video, I hope you like them, those are my favourite types of videos to watch so I hope you like watching them too because I think there's still another one from the things I brought at New York oh dear so I'm not going to ramble on although I do feel like I haven't chatted too much in this video I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing but anyway I'm just going to say goodbye and thank you very much for watching I hope you enjoyed it and if you did please give it a thumbs up and I'll see you again next time bye